Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome to another video here with me, Rich on Rich Aesthetic. This is an Apple tips video and it's for any of you who may be like me, which means that you're Apple fan. So you probably have AirPods or AirPods Max or something. You're hard of hearing and you have an iPhone. Now you probably already know that you can balance your audio. So if your like left ear is, you know, not as good as your right ear, meaning that, you know, it just sounds quieter. You can balance the audio to be a little bit louder on the left side to then make it sound kind of normal, like the same volume in both of your ears. However, that's just like the basics. If you have, like I said, an iPhone and AirPods, you can actually take a hearing test with an app called Mimi. I made a video about that just a couple weeks ago. So go ahead and check out that card or link in the description. If you already have an audiogram in your Apple Health app, then you're actually good. You don't have to deal with that. You maybe have imported an audiogram from, I don't know, your health service provider, or uh, if you have hearing aids, you may have had a way to input that. But I specifically did it with my AirPods. Okay, so what we can do is we can actually set up a custom audio setup for your AirPods and some Beats, I think it's like the Power Beats and Beats, uh, maybe the Studio Pro Buds or whatever. Anyways, they're gonna be right here what the supported headphones are. So as long as you have one of these headphones, then you can do this. So we're gonna go into the settings app and AirPods show up right at the top. Some of the Beats do too. So I'm gonna tap on that, scroll down go to accessibility and we're not there yet. Now you're gonna hit on the blue one there, audio accessibility settings, okay. And then one more, go up at the top, headphone accommodations. So I've turned mine off, so you should see something like this. We're gonna do the custom audio setup. Now, before I jump into this, the reason this is probably important for those of you who are similar to me is that my left ear is only worse at some frequencies compared to my right. I think it's the higher frequencies that my left ear is actually better on. So just by balancing the audio, yes, it's gonna make things louder for my left ear, which mostly will fix it, but it's not gonna make, it's, it's, it's not gonna be the best situation, right? And I, I wanna hear the music to at least some extent close to what the producer or artist wanted me to hear it as. All right, so we're gonna hit the blue button here, custom audio setup, and you'll get the splash screen, awesome. Now, we're it's super custom because we're gonna choose one of the audiograms. So I just took one today, uh, so I'm gonna use this audiogram. And now it's going to let me listen to this little track. And these are the recommended settings. And then I can compare it to the standard settings by just tapping on standard. Yeah, so in the custom one, those, I don't know what they're, like the the symbols, they, they just sound a little bit more balanced on both of my ears when I'm in the custom setup. So that's awesome. So I'm gonna go with use audiogram and it's gonna back out of that. And let me just change the headphones to transparency mode again here. <laughs> there, now I can hear myself better. Now you could tune the audio in other ways where it's like a balanced tone. So there's kind of like all the frequencies will kind of sound more like a little bit more flat. Uh, vocal range and then brightness, making the brighter parts of music a little bit louder. But this is specifically a video about the audiogram. This is because if we go to my health app here, and let me show you in hearing my audiogram. Yeah, so at the lower frequencies, my left ear is worse than my right ear and the higher frequencies, my left ear is better than my right ear. So because of this, sometimes things just sound a little bit off. Luckily down in the middle there of the one kilohertz to two kilohertz range, my ears are pretty comparable, um, but yeah, this is a nice fix. All right, let me know down in the comments below if you didn't know about this feature and learned something new. WWDC was also just a couple weeks ago, so I'm not sure where this video is coming out in you know, summer plans. Uh, but yeah, hit that like button, consider subscribing for more videos like this and others. And I'll catch you in the next one. Rich Aesthetic out. Peace.